Hey guys, what's up? It's Brian here from Electronic Reviews and today I'm going to be reviewing the PlayStation Move controller. So first off, let's take a look at the controller itself. Here it is. Here is the original PSN home button that you just use to turn it on and, you know, go to your PSN menu. Here is the new accept button, A button, X button, whatever you want to call it. But they still have the X square, triangle, and circle button that you're all able to reach while holding the controller. At the top here you have the new ping pong ball shaped top which is actually really spongy and has all the sensors in it and actually changes color based off if you win or lose the game and whatever color your home screen uh, background is. And on the back here you have the T trigger and uh, down here you have your ports which you can use to charge it and the mystery port which you use to plug accessories in like the gun accessory. And here is the wrist strap where you put your hand through that makes sure you don't sling you know your PlayStation Move controller into your TV you know with rage as like you know if you guys remember the Wii controller everyone was cracking their TVs and a lot of videos ended up on YouTube and that's pretty much it on the controller it's really comfortable it's more like a cylinder as compared to a rectangle with the Wii and you know you can just hold this for long periods of time and have lots of comfort with it and you know I have no trouble you know reaching all the buttons on the controller so overall the controller and you know the it's very comfortable and you know I just had no problems with it now what's this whole bundle come with I bought the uh, PlayStation Move bundle which is priced at hundred dollars and it comes with all this stuff here of course you get the PlayStation Move controller and you get the sports of champions games it comes with about six different sports games like ping pong volleyball uh, archery and some gladiator fighting game and one more game and, you know, it just works perfectly with PlayStation Move. And, you know, it may even be better than, the, you know, Wii Sports. You know, that's a big competition right there. But I just had a whole lot of fun with it, and I really had no problems with it. But uh, it's just like the Wii Sports, like I said. And, you know, it, you know, like the Wii Sports, Wii Sports gets boring after a while. And there's not too many PlayStation Move games right now. There's one where you can basically have a pet, like, monkey, animal, furry animal, whatever you want to call it. And you can interact with it. But that's really stupid because most people have cats and dogs and they're probably going to pay more attention to their little neopet or, you know, furry little monkey more than their actual dog or cat. And, you know, that's really stupid. But there's going to be a lot of upcoming games like SOCOM, Little Big Planet, maybe even Gran Turismo that work with PlayStation Move that's going to be really awesome. Because the only thing that the Wii is missing is hardcore games and HD graphics and that's what the PlayStation 3 has. So that's really awesome. Um, also, you get, you know, like I said, you get the, both the game, you get the PlayStation Move controller, and you get the webcam or camera, whatever you want to call it, which, you know, tracks the motion of your controller. Now, I had no problems whatsoever with, you know, losing the PlayStation Move controller while, you know, moving around with it. One problem with the Wii controller is if you go, you know, away from the sensor bar, it's going to lose, you know, where your controller is, and it's going to, you know, mess you up a lot. But I didn't really have that problem with the PlayStation Move controller. You can move around a lot more and it really won't lose sight of your controller if you know what I mean. Now if you already own a PlayStation 3 and you own a, a camera what's good about PlayStation Move is you can buy all this stuff separately so if you already have the camera all you have to do is just buy a $50 or $30 you know PlayStation Move game and uh, move controller and you won't have to spend you know another $40 on the cam itself which is really cool and if you don't own any of this stuff, they also made a PlayStation 3 PlayStation Move bundle, which is priced at $400. You get this stuff and all the stuff that comes with the original PlayStation um, console. So that's really cool. So overall, this is a really cool bundle, and it really opens up a whole new world of gaming for any of you PlayStation 3 gamers out there. I know all you Xbox 360 gamers out there, you're going to be getting Kinect soon. It's pretty much the same thing as this, but without controllers, and I will be doing a review on that as soon as it comes out. But overall, guys, this is just an awesome set, and I'm really happy with this, and I really wasn't expecting, you know, it to be this good. I actually like it a lot better than the Wii, and it's actually really worth it if you're looking for something different, you know, just playing, you know, Call of Duty all day. And uh, controllers and accessories themselves are not too bad, you know, price-wise. You can buy maybe about two or three more for about $100, and you can play ping pong with your friends, which is really awesome. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Also, follow me on Twitter for my latest news and content. And until next video, guys, catch you guys later. Peace.